what is up my friends so what did i tell ya i told y'all in the kissing booth too and they explained this ain't over this is far from over and we have just gotten some confirmation about that before we get into any of this let me go ahead and ask you to go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now we are about to reach close to 16,000 subscribers our goal is 20,000 subscribers i know together we can get there this is your one stop for all the stuff you love in pop culture from movies tv shows video games music all that good stuff so go ahead and hit that subscribe give it a thumbs up let's get right into it so the kissing booth 3 is coming and i told you in the kissing booth 2 ending explained that this is based on a book series it's not just a sequel to the older book the kissing booth 1 but this um, is part of a bigger series that already has four stories in. So I said that we might be getting four movies or we could get three movies. And the third movie would be just the two last uh, stories put together. And I think that they're definitely going to be doing that route. It would make a lot of sense because I heard that um, Road Trip and Beach House are shorter than the other one. So it makes sense to have them both together. But as I said... I really believe that this next uh, movie was going to focus on Elle sort of having a moment or a good portion of it trying to find exactly who she is and what she wants to do. According to the cast as well that this was filmed in secret. Nobody even knew about this and the film is already in post-production. So that means they're basically just editing, getting together the sound, all of that, making sure it's all good to go. So. It's pretty close to being done, if not done, in the next month or two or so. And we will be seeing it sometime in 2021. So they're really just going full steam on ahead with this. And there's no doubt that this is a very popular series. So I was never doubting that Netflix was going to be um, doing this third one. I just didn't know they went ahead and did it already. But as I said in my any explain for the Kissing Booth 2, the first one was a huge success. Like I think it had some pretty amazing numbers compared to other stuff. And it just follows in the footsteps as well as to all the boys I've ever loved. And it's just pretty much a no brainer that they would continue with this. So they went on to say that the Kissing Booth 3 will be set in the summer before Elle heads off to college. As we know, she has a big decision to make. Will she go to Harvard or will she go to Berkeley? Will she be with her boyfriend or will she be with her best friend? And this is where she's going to have to choose what exactly is going to be um, like her ultimate decision because it can either make or break either relationship. And I mean, we don't know exactly what um, is going to happen in this next film. Um, I mean, they could deviate from the original source. Uh, I'm not going to really talk about that, but um, I don't want to give no um, spoilers or anything like that. So that's the reason I'm not really going to go deep into that. If y'all want to see a video of me talking about that, give this video a thumbs up and we will definitely talk about the possibilities of what could happen. But this is just pretty much me just talking about the second film where it left off and just where it could go but if y'all want more in depth and reading what happens in the beach house what happens in the road trip all of that make sure you give it a thumbs up but i think one of the big things that we're definitely going to see in the third film which many people i've seen on social media as well as on my video for the ending explain for kissing booth 2 is people want to know where is marco going to fit into all of this as we know he isn't going to go down without a fight and so i think we're going to be definitely seeing that um, be explored a lot more so yeah there's a lot that can happen so let me know your thoughts below on what do you think about all of this are you excited or not for the kissing booth 3 do you think that this could really flesh out into a bigger series or do you think the third film will be the last let me know in the comments below anyways as always make sure you check out my other video talking about the ending exploit for kissing booth 2 if you haven't already and as always make sure you subscribe let's get to 20 down subscribers we're on the road and that's going to do it for me for all the stuff you love about Netflix, movies, TV shows, music, video games. This is your one-stop nerd round right here. Make sure you follow me on all my social medias on Twitter, Anchor, as well as my website, nerdround.com. I'll see all of you next time. Stay safe. Stay positive.